it's Kendra, and yeah. today we're doing a get ready with me. Yes, and then I do the little. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> what is up, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> so happy to have you guys here. Today I'm filming the collab with Anna. <laughs> so you guys need to stick around. We did a little get ready with me. <laughs> Mouth click. Okay. <laughs> okay guys, as you already heard, we're just doing a quick little get ready with me. Well, it's not gonna be quick and it might be a really long video. So you can always do that little like speed thing on YouTube. I'm fun and, like, editing. Yeah, it's gonna be I'm a gonna... doozy to edit. <laughs> but you can listen to us faster if you want or you can just watch the whole thing because it'll be fun. I promise. It'll be fun. But make sure after you watch this video to head on over to her channel, which obviously will be linked <laughs> down below. We did um, a 10 minute full glam challenge. Full glam and in 10 minutes. May or may not have failed miserably. I mean, <laughs> I mean like I think it was pro it, would look, it looked better than this. It's probably like my best job ever. Best thing ever. <laughs> yeah. All right, so. Yeah, if you want to see how to get these makeup looks, hear us chat about random things, life. Let's just keep watching. Keep watching. <laughs> you guys already know what I'm going in with. Like, the you guys don't know me. Press, so, <laughs> this is the two face hangover. All right, so maybe some of you guys know me. All the time. And then I'm just extra. You guys already know. I use my. <laughs> Two primers. <laughs> I've I actually tried your method like the other day. I think yeah, it was for a video or maybe it was a video that went wrong because I was having so many camera problems. <laughs> so I'm just like drying down I just over here. My Fifty something dollar mark by <laughs> Jacob's bronze. But yeah, I tried it the other day with like the the Becca primer and the the setting thing. The which one? Smashbox. <laughs> the Smashbox spray, and I loved it. Yeah, it was so nice. Favorite. I'm like, oh, my skin looks amazing. And then we're both using yeah. Fenty. We got our Fenty Beauty. I foundations. have 190. Mine's 140. I used to use 150, which is a really good shade too. But then winter happened. <laughs> not like I get winter is coming. Not like I really get super tan anyways. But do you watch um, Game of Thrones? Yes, I do. Thank you. Oh ever. my gosh. When people say they don't watch Game of Thrones, I'm like, are you even from this like, like who generation? Are you? Yeah. I'm obsessed. That is like I think my favorite show like of all time. It is an amazing show. We're really lacking without Game of Thrones in our life. I know. For a while. I'm so sad that th there's only one season left. I'm like, why? Like why? It's going to be. And it's going to come in like next year. <laughs> I'm so sad. I need it now. Please. Yeah, Alex and I, that's like our show that we always watch together. It's the best. Do you and Sam watch shows together? Mm -hmm. yeah. well, most shows, except for like the ones he hates, like <laughs> the girly ones. Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> yeah. Scandal. Oh my gosh. He hates those. Yes. I watch Scandal. Funny story. I've like always watched Scandal and then they like screwed up the show. You know when they just like do the worst yeah. move they could ever do? Yeah. So I stopped watching When they it. kill someone so amazing. Yeah, <laughs> or they like ruin a relationship, like yeah. literally just ruin it so bad. Right. So I stopped watching it for a while, like two years, but then I was just like lacking on shows and I was like, yeah. I wonder if I could give it a try again. So right. I just like skipped that part and <laughs> went to right that after. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yep, I did that. Yeah, um, I'm forcing Alex to watch Friends right now. <gasps> yes, I've watched Friends and I'm actually yes. going back and restarting it. I'm only it's on like so, episode so Like eight. that's one of my all-time favorite yes. shows for sure. And it's just like timeless. Like mm -hmm. I feel like I could just watch that over and over and over and never yes. get sick of it. <sighs> oh no! <gasps> there goes my <laughs> Ermin Decay concealer. I've always wanted <laughs> Naked to try skin. that one too. But well, I never have. Here are If you, well, you probably have your, <laughs> your yeah. three concealers on. <laughs> just two this time. Oh, okay. I'm using the newer. Um, well, they changed their name. They used to be Makeup Revolution. Now they just go by Revolution. Oh yeah, oh, like Revolution Pro mm -hmm. or something like that. This yeah. is their new concealer, and it is good. And it's seven bucks, I think. But anyways, it's super, super creamy, and it blends out super easily. But you guys know my favorite concealer is. But mild. <laughs> photo focus. Um, photo focus concealer. But I really do like mixing concealers because the Wet n Wild one just isn't light enough to brighten. But yeah, so I always use the Wet n Wild one because I love it. It creases less than. Sorry for the annoying tapping. <laughs> <laughs> just, just 
interrupt you like so <laughs> it creases less truly than any concealer I've ever used I was so surprised by like, it so surprised it's the only concealer that like also does that for me is Tarte Shape Deep. Yeah. But I don't reach for that all the time because it's a bit like too much for it me. It is really full coverage. And I really did like, my favorite concealer before them was NARS Radiant Creamy, but since it, they stopped being cruelty free. So, I don't understand that at all. Like it's if you're weird. successfully yeah. not, or if you're successfully cruelty free, why would you yeah. change that? Like, And like they use the excuse, it's like, well, we're not, the, we're not testing on animals and it's like we know that you don't have a factory that tests on animals But you are allowing but I really did love NARS up until then so it was really yeah. sad when that happened If you really like NARS Radiant Creamy or you've always wanted to try it This was like the closest thing I could find that had a similar consistency yeah, never tried. Probably forgot to mention other things that I used this powder and, and I'm like this forget powder. about it <laughs> totally we're just chatting chatty Kathy is over here oh yeah we did a <laughs> yes it, after this video you have to go over to her channel full glam in 10 minutes it was, it was not horrendous. so full glam not really. I didn't even get to mascara or blush or highlight so if you would like to see <laughs> that train wreck please go over to her channel we were laughing and screaming the whole time so it won't be obnoxious though, I promise. <laughs> yeah, let's not turn them away. <laughs> Stop clicking. Anyway. Ulta or Sephora? Oh, that is such a great Isn't question. Isn't that hard? That is so hard. I was thinking about that the other day because I was thinking like, oh, where should Kendra and I go after we film I our videos? Because I don't, well. Are you a rouge at Sephora? No, VIB. <sighs> Are you really gonna say yeah? Like, darn it! I was like, I could buy it for you, and you could just like Venmo me. I could. I could. I have. I got cash. Yes. I don't know. Like, but hard regardless thing is, of the sale. Yeah. Forget about the sale, people. Or all the time. That's a really good question. I don't know. Like, I find myself going to Sephora more, but I don't know mm -hmm. if that's because I prefer it or if it's just because right. they have what I need. Yeah. But like, I. That's such a good question. It's so hard. I like the vibe of Ulta more. At least in my area, I feel like the Sephora so feels a little bit, yeah, a little yeah, bit snooty. I can see and it's thing. it's really annoying because sometimes I'll go in there with like hardly any makeup on at all, and people will be like, "Oh, sweetie, do you need some help?" And no, that's like, like, horrible. Oh my gosh! Like, and there's nothing that. wrong, of course, with like asking, like, "Oh, do you need some help?" Yes, yeah. obviously that's customer service. But like, just how they like look at me or treat me, or they're yeah. like. Just, it's like, you know what I mean? And I'm like, honey, you have no idea. Like, <laughs> <laughs> listen, you, you haven't have seen no my idea. YouTube channel. Like, you, you have no idea. It's funny because I've gone to a Sephora with like Alex's mom, mm -hmm. and she like will bring me along to like <laughs> help her with recommendations. Yeah, picks, to, help like, you I help know so stuff much out. Yeah. about things. And the lady was saying. <sighs> I don't remember what it was, but she was saying that this one lipstick was long lasting and the other one wasn't. And I'm like, girl, no, you're like, do you that's even wrong. Know? Like, do you, <laughs> do you even know what you're talking about? <laughs> when at Ulta, they're so sweet. It's so chill. All the time. They're chill. Yeah. They're so sweet. They're like, hey, what's up, girl? Like, if they just talk, like, they'll still ask, do you need help with anything? But then it's like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> No, I feel it. Nyx no filter, finishing powder in the shade, light beige. Okay. Light beige. <laughs> Not beige. But yeah, lately I've been going to Ultim more just because I've been kind of on a drugstore kick. Yeah, I so I'm close. Totally and they're trying to buy. Beauty. Yes. Did you I buy anything? So much. Well, I mainly From did online Plum? because it's so oh, hard yeah. to get on in store. But if you're like platinum member, I think you get free shipping regardless. So I didn't mm. care. So I bought um, what did I buy? Oh, I bought another one of my favorite primers, the Becca mm -hmm. First Light Priming Filter. I bought um, some things for a giveaway I'm doing. So if you guys haven't heard, if you don't know, now you oh know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what else did I buy? We won't, oh, we won't. I bought this little mini because <laughs> I was like, I'm going to use it for travel anyway. Right, so. yeah. I also already placed two, no, one. I had to place it in two separate orders, but I bought two. Um, orders of the Sephora VIB Rouge sale already yesterday. I placed two orders. 
Oh my gosh. Um, That's so funny. But I bought my first ever Natasha. Din I didn't buy one of the huge ones. I bought the five. Oh my the gosh. The five pan palettes that are like $50. I want them so I bad. Know, I know. But I truly can't justify I it. Can't. Even with the sale, I'm I like, know. I can't. I can't do it. Like, if it's if a palette is $80 it's or so below, expensive. okay. But more than $80, I genuinely cannot justify Same. it. So I did not buy the. I was going to buy the sunset palette mini but it doesn't have the greatest reviews also I heard it's like literally this big mm. but the five pan palettes are 50 bucks and so I bought one because I've always wanted to try her shadows and I never I've heard the yeah. most amazing things so, so I was like I might as well just the rave try this out. Yeah. I don't understand why they do 15% off and, and then 20% off like why? so I'm not <laughs> Well, actually, I am gonna buy something with you. <laughs> You're right. Yo, fifty percent. That's what friends do. Yeah. I hate like the number fifteen. Per like when people it, are like, there's like, <laughs> it's like smoke all the powder. <laughs> when oh people are like, we are having a fifteen percent off sale. I always think like it's not worth it. Right. Yeah. I, I know. I'd rather about. wait till a except bigger sale. for when it comes to those like luxury brands, yeah. like super high end brands. I feel like. That's when you gotta snatch it. Yeah. With those sales, then it then it's kind because of worth you might it. as well. Oh no, we were on brows. This is like thirty minutes. I'm not even lying. <laughs> I'm like I'm not. Even... Nope. I feel like I have here. a million things like going through my mind right now because I'm like trying to actually focus. Like I just realized, I'm like, why am I not doing my makeup routine? Like I did my eyes, but normally I have to powder like the, my forehead because I don't like that little crease or like my smile lines I know, I get and I forgot that about so that I'm like why because we're like talking that I'm doing makeup we're having like, so much fun. I need to make sure like you guys can see things <laughs> I know I like don't want to keep covering my face but I don't know if I am or not right like <laughs> so guys so when did you start getting into makeup oh not not when I was young me neither honestly actually. um in like long story short in the shortest way I can possibly describe it <laughs> I was super not tomboyish but kind of tomboyish mm -hmm. um, I just played sports so the only thing I would wear when I was a freshman in high school was mascara and then if I had time I'd sometimes use like my mom's foundation yeah and I would literally just like you know how we used to all do it like pump it the on the hands, hands. Yeah, and, yeah me too yeah do that so I had um, mascara but I didn't even do like more than like one coat and by one coat I literally mean just like one swipe <laughs> so like it was just not very it didn't look like I was natural. wearing anything and then my best friends were like really into highlighter at the time highlighter nope there's no such thing I'm an eyeliner at the time which I don't ever wear now and so I started getting into eyeliner and I'd wear like the worst version of eyeliner you've ever seen in your entire life especially like on like lash line. small eyes like me yet like oh. all over the upper and all over the lower That's so funny um but that was really just like a pure thing like I didn't really care for it but my best friends did it so I was like I want to try right. yeah um and then I stopped doing that and really just wore like I said foundation and um mascara mm -hmm. and then when I was a senior in high school I started like buying those like you know the drugstore you can get like covergirl like one pan shadow yeah and it was like a bronzy shimmery one and so I just buy that and just put it all over my lid if I had extra time in the morning but I dyed my hair dark brown and like my natural super fair yeah so I had to fill in my eyebrows at the time oh, but like that was yeah. before people filled in their eyebrows right so I bought like a brown eyeliner pencil eyeliner from the drugstore oh just my like gosh. Filled in. It was, That's great. I mean, it's horrible, but you gotta do what you gotta yeah. do. Yeah. And then um, I fell in love with YouTube, and YouTube was kind of like my way to makeup because it wasn't even like makeup YouTuber specifically that I watched. What I did just you start with um, Bethany Moda when she was like younger and did like I DIY her, videos. Actually. And she's super cute. Like not my style at all. I love her to death though. But I love the idea of being on YouTube. Right. So then I started finding all these YouTubers, started watching makeup YouTubers, um, started watching people like that and just started teaching myself uh, makeup and that was how I got into it. So it was really, it's really only been like four or three years. That you started YouTube? Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> this <is> makeup. <laughs> My initial question. <laughs> no. Yeah. YouTube, I wanted to start five years ago, but I just kept putting it off, putting it off, putting it off, bit of baby, made excuses and then I finally did it. Yeah. 
So I wish I would have started when I actually wanted to, because can you imagine? Were people um, like supportive of you when you started or like did you keep it kind of on the down low or? Nobody really cared. My, really? So my best friend at the time, we're not really that close anymore. Uh huh. It was hard with her because I felt like she didn't really get it. Yeah, and she won't watch this video, so I'm not bad mouthing her. I'm just saying, <laughs> no, yeah. Like, she just didn't get it. Yeah. She didn't understand it, and so it's really hard. Like when you're like quote unquote best friend, right? Yeah, doesn't understand the like your passion or what you right. want to do. That's hard. But my, but Sam, he was super like supportive, like super supportive. Yeah. He was like, "Why aren't you filming right now? We've been wanting Aww. to do this forever." Yeah. So he was super supportive, and my sister is super supportive too. She loves Aww. that I do it, but it's always weird because a lot of people just don't understand right. like, what it's all about or like that it's actually a job rather than just a hobby. Yeah. And it's hard because like YouTube and like Google AdSense don't care about the smaller people so like you never get information that you want out of them. Yep. I like that we're like on the same step here. So it's <laughs> not like you're completely ahead of me. I'm like, okay, well that's good. I'm or just at the end of the video and you're just chilling, you're like, can you hurry up, please? <laughs> so he did this intro and yes, outro. Brows, girl. I am sometimes sweating I know. like I'm in <laughs> Texas. Like, oh my gosh. We've been here for a minute. It's hot out today. Yeah. Is it cold in Utah right now? Um, let's look. <laughs> let's look. It did snow the other day, which blows. Mm. But it melts really fast because it doesn't stay hot like or right. cold long enough because it's already spring. Oh, it yeah. is 58. Oh. Which is cool. A little different from here. It's cold. Yeah. It, it, here's the thing. It's warm for Utah, but it's cold. Right. And oh, everywhere Definitely else. cold for here. Yeah. Like, even I think it's cold, but, like, when you've come off of a summer of, like, or a winter of snow and, uh super cold days that feels kind of warm like i'll see people walking around in like a short and t-shirt and i'm like uh where's your coat <laughs> where is your coat because i got mine on i know but it was weird like being in michigan like i would be freezing and everyone's like wearing t-shirts and i'm like what like, can you please i did get, i did get kind of used to it though actually after a while yeah i got used to it it still sucks but you kind right. of get used to it yeah totally i hate it but what can you do <laughs> <laughs> Have you lived anywhere else besides Utah and California? When I was five, we moved to Colorado for nine months. It's so pretty there. I love Colorado. It's yeah, so right pretty. outside of Denver. It's where my uncle and cousins live. Um, but we only lived there for nine months and then we literally moved back to the exact same house on the exact same street in the exact same city of I shouldn't say that. Um, <laughs> we'll just edit that. <laughs> Me! Um, California. This Max. is driving me crazy. I'm like, why do I sweat right here? Um, I always <laughs> get where I always sweat right here, like the top of my dimple chin. <laughs> see that dimple? Well, now I get to see it even more. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> oh my gosh. Michigan is somewhere I've never been. It's really pretty. Like, you see all of the four seasons there. Yeah. That's kind of how it is in Utah. Yeah. Um, but it's just. <laughs> Not for me. Yep, not. Just not for you. Nope. <laughs> yeah. Nope. Hardcore California girls. Nowhere to go here. for the beach. Uh, oh no yeah, way. Michigan has Lake Michigan. That's true. But it's nothing like the beach at all. Like it's it's so funny because you go to the beach and you you'll see like parents with their kids on boogie boards and they're like, <laughs> like what do you what waves? Like, Look at this wave. Here comes That's a big funny. one and it's like, <laughs> and you're like. Do you know what a wave is? Have like, you been to a real, like, beach? Oh my gosh. Do you have any, like, scary, like, beach moments, like, where you've been pulled over? Or, like, pulled under yeah. and you're like, I'm actually gonna die? Yeah. I think that happened a lot more as a kid. I feel like this is not to sound like <laughs> I'm so good at the beach. But, like, <laughs> I'm good at the beach. <laughs> good at the beach. <laughs> oh, you're good at... <laughs> You're good at singing, you're good at sm I'm good at the beach. <laughs> but I genuinely feel like no one does the beach like Kendra. <laughs> I genuinely feel like I've just based off of like growing up in California, like close to the beach, that like I know what to do in a scary situation. Like if I feel like holy crap, this this wave I see is literally going to demolish me, like I'm gonna stop breathing. Yeah. Um the first thing I do is I just, just like away. <laughs> I just get up and walk away. 
I, get out of the water, <laughs> go back to the beach. <laughs> Duh. I just like, the first thing I do is as soon as it gets as, like super close to me, I'll just dive like, under under yeah. to like as low as I can get because then I won't be close to like right but I've had plenty of terrifying experiences you know really um just like most kids I guess yeah that go to the beach. I've I had it once where I genuinely thought I was gonna die one day it, it can be I, so scary it's so scary but I, like I'm a good swimmer like, yeah I literally just put through you know so I'm good at the beach all that. I'm, I'm good at <laughs> I'm good at the what. <laughs> yeah, I did swimming lessons as yeah. a kid too. Um, and so, like, I don't have any problems with that. Like, I'm a good swimmer. Yeah. But uh, one day I was out, like, on a boogie board and I had it strapped <gasps> to yeah. my arm. And there was such a big wave. And yeah, normally when you have big waves, you just dive under and you're fine. Yeah. But that's not that I hate all the time. To a boogie board and it was so big, I'm like, I can't go with the wave because yeah. it's just gonna crash over me anyway. I can't go under it because I have this flotation device strapped Stuck. to me. Stuck. I can't let go of it yeah. because I mean, if it was really like live or die, obviously I would get rid of the yeah. boogie board. <laughs> but anyway, it was so big and it dragged me underneath and I literally tumbled and slammed on like the ocean floor. Yeah. It, and then the boogie their noses board, all the time. Yeah. And then the boogie board was like crashing into me too. It was awful. And then I would try to like get up and breathe. The second I would get up, a giant wave would come crash on me. That I was like, so scary. <laughs> like I couldn't breathe. And then Alex saw me because he was standing on the beach like watching me. And then he was like, like I'm dying. Me out. Yeah. <laughs> Please, please assist. Jeez, hello. <laughs> yeah, so that, that was not fun, but. I can imagine. I love going in the ocean. Even if it's like freezing cold, I'll go swimming. Yeah. I love it. All right, I think we're Makeup looking is for bronzed art. enough. I know, I love being bronzed. So my favorite product is bronzer. Yeah. yeah. And then highlight. And then brows. No, wait, bronzer? Mm. Just like I'm not gonna think about it because it's gonna bother me. This all looks. Decent. Okay. I wanted to do a red lip, but I always do red lips, so I feel like I feel like your go-to lip is like orangey. Yep. Orange. Red. Orangey. In fact, I brought that red. one too. You did. Doll. Let's see. Kylie Cosmetics <laughs> doll. <laughs> I was gonna say it's either Kylie Cosmetics doll or ColourPop like Reve yes, or something yes, like that. There's then there's the ColourPop like Lux lipstick, yes. right? And it, then there's a Too Faced there's bullet lipstick that I really like called. Where, oh yeah, where my peach and that is little at. peachy. Yeah, those yeah. components are so. And cute. the lipstick's really great quality too. Like it lasts forever. Like I just want to like look nice and yeah. put together. I always go with like super bronze, yes. highlighted, glowy, and then like bronzy, you know, yep. situation. Yep. And like maybe like a glossy nude lip or Ooh, something, or like yes. the bold versions of red or something. Yep. I guess yep. I don't know. Yeah. I feel like my most or brown, natural with like the grungy red lip. brown yeah. lips. You rock the it. grungy lips, <laughs> oh, girl. I love you. that. I feel like I'm really good about using all of my makeup. I feel like a lot of people get into like the habits of what they like to use. Yeah. But for me, you're that's better than me because a lot of times <laughs> I use the exact same things every single day. Oh my gosh! Seriously. Yes. I mean, like you find what you love. Yeah. And I like I know what I love, but I also it's so fun for me to like use different things every and like single day and I get things. so excited to do yeah. my makeup like I love doing makeup but when it's like different products and you're doing different things all the time I don't know it's fun I really still love and adore eyeshadow but lately I've loved the like super neutral eye look I, I just feel like it's really on yeah. trend right now like yeah having like you know what's on trend is blue eyeshadow. Totally. Blue That's why I wanted to do blue yeah. when I was like. Like with the KKW um, the cobalt, beauty yeah. like launch, everyone's wearing blue. Yep. And I feel like I'm seeing all these palettes come out with blue. Like we got the blue honey. Blue honey, I don't want to dig my nail into here, so that's why I'm <laughs> pulling it very it, carefully. It wouldn't be the first time, <laughs> trust me. And then we have the Tarte, like, joke mm -hmm. April, po I April know. Pools, April, April Pools, Pools palette. I was telling Kendra, I think it's all, like no. Like, I, yeah, yeah, I think they actually are going to release it. But I think, like, if you actually look at the pictures, like, why would, you put, in, why yeah. would you put in so much effort to, A, do a photo shoot, like, with the palette. Mm -hmm. They bought all these beads, like, made it look And, like, funky, even the imprint, edit, the 
the what are the what are the pans are like even imprinted imprinted yeah. with tart. Like, why would you put so much effort into designing something that's gonna be fake? You know yeah. what I mean? And I feel like it's all a marketing tactic to get people like, oh, we want that so bad, and they're gonna be like, guess what? We listen to you. Mm -hmm. It's coming, and yep. everyone's gonna be excited then. I literally just noticed like how <laughs> how pretty your eyes are because they're like blue, and then they go like. Almost like lime green. Yeah, I have inside. like That's yellow, so cool. like a yellowy ring. I love it. On the inside of my eyes. I <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> you're so oh, thank sweet. Thank you so much. <laughs> you're so sweet. I forgot to count my nose. Well, <laughs> at least you remembered now. <laughs> at least I have time. Yeah. In my, in my video, than, I didn't have time. <laughs> the, when I filmed my, my one video, it was that like, oh, the one I did, the orange cream one. Yeah. I forgot to highlight my inner, inner corner of my brow bone. Oh and I was my like, gosh. I Why? Didn't, I didn't realize that afterwards. I was like, hopefully nobody catches me oh on this my. one. Well, now, now, now they really have. <laughs> but guess what? Now I don't they care. Know. I don't care. <laughs> it's a little late now, huh? Oh, I loved that. Because I, I feel like it made your eyes pop so it was. much. I really it was do like, like that shadow, too. Oh, <laughs> I love it. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> it's so pretty. <laughs> Sorry, I'm reaching across. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. <laughs> and I'm back. I just needed to get this little palette for my brow bone highlight shade. This is the steps I didn't get to last time. Bronzer and or no highlight and blush. There we go. So I'm I blushed up with Milani um, baked blush and Luminoso. And now I'm going to highlight with. I don't think I've mentioned like any of the products I've been using. I know I using. probably <laughs> haven't either. Let's see, Anastasia bronzer in rich amber. We have the ColourPop main chick blush and now I'm using champagne Ooh, pop. Bye. I love it. Love it so much. I love highlighters. Becca highlighters and Anastasia so highlighters good. are my so favorite. Good. I've always are. wanted to try the like Anastasia like so Hollywood highlight. Oh I have it. They only like sell it on Anastasia's website now. They don't do it no, like they, at Sephora, right? No, they don't even have it on her website anymore. No they way. They only have the... They only have like one shade, the, right? Like the purpley grayish, like Riviera oh, or yeah. something like that shade. Like the cool toned shade. Why did like they rose stop gold with those? maybe? I heard they were so I amazing. don't know. It's funny because when I I can't I feel like I can't talk and do makeup at the same time. I'm so bad at it. Like I need to focus on one thing. Otherwise I will just take forever. Dang, you're way ahead of me now. Cause I haven't even started on eyes. Shoot. Oh, I'll slow down. Oh no! <laughs> Stop it! Stop right now! No. <laughs> I will uh um take five minutes for my mascara. Oh my gosh. Oh, question. What is like does Sam have like a favorite like makeup look that you do? Like is there something that he's just like, "Oh my gosh, you look so pretty like when I you do this." Know. Like does he have preference or is he just like he yeah, kind of just supports, every day. yeah. <laughs> he kind of just supports like whatever um like look I'm doing at the moment. Like sometimes I'll look at him and be like, "I feel like my makeup looks so good today." And he'll just be like, "Yeah, it looks really great." But he doesn't really like say like that is it. Right. You know what I mean? I don't yeah. Know. But I always do yeah, like red I feel like lips, I so maybe always, he likes that because I always yeah. do that. Oh. I always ask, like if I do a makeup look that's kind of out of my comfort zone, I always ask Alex, I'm like, does this look okay? Like, do you like this? And he's like, yes, it looks beautiful. Like, what? And then I'll post it and everyone likes it. It's just, it's yeah. weird. We were talking about this earlier, yeah. but it's just like kind of weird to do totally know. different makeup from what you yeah. normally do and get outside your comfort zone and you're like, wait, does this look great? <laughs> and you don't, you just don't know like what you guys are gonna love. Like we try and do things that you love, but we don't know what you love. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use Kylie Bronze palette. I have literally no idea what look I'm gonna do today, but easy enough for a red to pop on. I was so jealous when I was watching your video. I'm like, she loves Kylie Cosmetics. <laughs> okay, oh I God. really do love the the highlighters, the, the blush, the it lips, the eyeshadow. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, Let and me I get here. so mad when people like hate on it, and I'm like, you hating on it because you haven't tried it yet, or because yeah. other people have hated on it because they don't like Kylie Cosmetics. You know what I mean? I really like it, but she had like a buy one get one half off or free. Yes, or buy two the something. highlighter. Yeah, yeah, and so and blush and blush, and I almost bought the blush, but then like I forgot about it, and then I'm like, ooh, I need to get the X rated because Kendra. Yeah, <laughs> and then I missed it. I almost so. brought that with me, but. But you know what? One day, let's see. I'm looking bronzy. Over oh, me over here, just fanning off my face. 
Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, because you, all you have to do is mascara and lips, right? Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't go super fast. Oh my gosh. And also, I'm horrible at mascara. I do like all over two layers face. of mascara every single time because... Well, I don't like clumpy mascara. That's not me, yeah. but I do like, you know, to see the lashes. Like, yeah. I used to always worry, like, oh, this is such a bold lip color. People are going to wonder why I'm wearing yeah. it. And now I don't give a rat's A if somebody wonders yeah. why I'm wearing a bold lip color. Because I like wearing yeah. a bold lip color, you know? Yeah. Like, I just like the way it looks. Do you ever wear, like... <laughs> Like blues are like really no okay. Oh. I the first blue lipstick I ever got was Jeffree Star Mermaid Blood. Oh yeah, and so That's that really was super one. recent. Cool. Yeah. So I've never really had like a dark yeah or not dark. I mean like a bold like a blue or black or purple. Right. Well, I actually I have tons of purple. That's why. But mainly blue, green, or black. Did you see the Kylie Cosmetics new green color? It's like a oh, olive yeah. green. I think it looks sick. I think it looks really cool. Yeah. Like it's a very wearable green, yeah. in my opinion. I want so, it. So I think it looks really cool. Is he like really He's close with film. your family? I'm sure they like love him. Yeah. I know I haven't like met him, met him. Like, yeah, we're gonna go he out to dinner like, after this. Yeah. <laughs> but like I get such like fun vibes from him and he seems like so nice. I mean obviously like if he's yeah. your husband he's gotta be cool. <laughs> he's alright. Yeah. yeah. I just dropped my Q tip. Um no he's really awesome and he's like super super outgoing and I've only gotten more outgoing. Actually YouTube has helped me because in the past yeah. I was like really cool not super quiet really loud around my friends but like I was a lot with confidence yes. I found too like for sure yeah I was like super quiet with new people because I just wasn't super just confident or outgoing really yeah and which is funny because like as a kid my dream was like entertainment industry but like I don't know people just knock you down as kids and depends on if you get yeah. back up or not did you know like YouTube when you were a kid or did you just know like oh no. entertainment? Well, I want my dream dream was singing and like yeah. I, I still love singing. It's still one of my dreams But so maybe one day like when I have more money, I'll like get into a little bit more of that. That's but, so cool. Um, and then I, I don't know and then YouTube came around and I was like this is an outlet for me to kind of do that yeah. stuff. So oh, yeah, for sure. I feel like that's like me to the T except my dream job was acting yeah and I like singing a lot too but like if yeah. I have to pick one definitely totally. acting um but like singing came with a lot of the acting that I did because yeah of like musicals and all of that mm -hmm. so but totally yeah and then YouTube is just yep like you said that perfect outlet it really and, is and it kind of like can open your like open the door into those things too. right like, like I mean like be you, a, Alex yeah. and I are engaged but this this Cross is your finger. <laughs> <laughs> one day Alex. So, <laughs> no, but we've been together for five and a half years, which is so cool. Yeah. I love that. And um, it's crazy because actually, so we met the very beginning of my so of our sophomore year of high school, and um, I specifically remember it was like late at night, and we were on Skype, and we were Cute. we were supposed to be on Skype. <laughs> And I so we weren't doing like the the video messaging. We were just like just chatting. typing, yeah, yeah, chatting. And he's like, "So like this sounds crazy, and I don't know why, but for whatever reason, like I can picture myself like being with you for the rest of my life." And I was like, "Wait, mm -hmm. like wait, what? Like, cause <laughs> so cute. it was so cute, and it was so crazy. Like I know that might like scare some mm -hmm. people, but it felt like so right so quickly." Yeah. And it was almost like, it's weird because I feel like people ask like, oh, when do you know, you know? And it's like, there's no, you just, like, there's no, no. specific there's time. There's this like, weird yeah. like feeling and it's like, it's mutual and I don't know, it's hard to describe. Yeah. So, you know what's gonna be fun is editing this video. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's gonna be like 50 Mine minutes. Mine is gonna be like five minutes to edit because it's a 10 minute challenge. <laughs> and yours is gonna be like But I love these three videos. hours later. Get ready with Oh my gosh, yeah. It's so fun to watch too. I'm like, I take for. <laughs> I take forever on lipstick <laughs> application too because it needs to be all like I get precise, it. But... I get it. Oh, I just like can't talk Dr. during this head. part because no, you're so hungry funny. now. Yeah. Hey guys, <laughs> you like my <laughs> shifted lips? Yeah. Let's see, is it even enough? I know that's kind of bad, but it's good enough. <laughs> it's good enough. We're gonna we're gonna stop there, but okay. <laughs> Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching today. Please subscribe if you have not already. So much fun. Join the fam. Three videos yes. a week. 
You're not gonna want to miss them. It's very consistent. She's amazing. Well, subscribe. Sometimes I'm be a little flaky. <laughs> <laughs> All with good reason. Yes, We're very of course. busy. <laughs> also, check out my social medias if you have not already. They'll be on the screen as well as listed down below in the description box. And don't forget to check out her video. It is a blast. Kind of a nightmare, but also kind of a blast at the same time. <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys go though. We've been talking for a really long time, so have a great morning, Nuni. We need to get night. some Mongolian barbecue. Yes, we're going to get some food. <laughs> and we're gonna go to Sephora and use Shop that. Shop around. Use that VIB Rouge discount. Rouge. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.